And I know that, you know what the craziest thing is? I know that no matter what we say in this video, it is going to get contradicted and it's going to be twisted into something that means nothing. Hey weirdos! Hey! So we are back for another video. I know! Shocking! Shocking! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we are Who trash. are the Yeah, um, we're really bad at this. Yeah, whole anyways, thing. we are back for another video and we are just gonna get right into it. You guys have seen what we're doing because you guys are the ones that sent us the stuff. So yeah. let's just jump right into it. We don't wanna be one of those people that like talks for five minutes and then gets the video started. <laughs> Half of our videos. Literally. All right, yeah. So we're gonna do assumptions about us that you guys think are true, and uh, let's go. I also think some people didn't realize that I could see your Instagram. So people were sending messed up things, and I'm like, I could see you. Yeah, y'all are mean. Yeah. Alyssa is more messy than Sam. Love you guys. I feel like we're equal. I feel like we're equal. Yeah. Messy. I think that's why we work out because like we both don't give a fuck. What's really, what's really cool too is that we're messy in like the same ways. Mm -hmm. I assume that Sam was more of a closed off person, whereas Alyssa was more outgoing. Um, no, I mean, I'm really <laughs> outgoing like once you get to know me. So when she meets new people <laughs> is very shy. Not just- To the point where she does not speak a word. Not and just then you're new just like, people, not just new people, but like new people that are important. Like the first time like I met your family or like the first time like I met like your friends, I'm very like scared. Like I turned into that girl from high school who was just like, they ask you how you are and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Yeah, she like sits in the corner without yeah. saying a word. Yeah, but I can go talk to a stranger like easily. Yeah, it's weird. You guys argue a lot. We argue a normal <laughs> amount. Yeah, I, think. Like, I mean, it's nothing like big or like a big deal. Yeah. It's mainly it's just nothing like, like you cheated on me. No, no, it's like, well, clean up your fucking shit or like. It's more like if if we're having like bad days or something or if something has like gone wrong, we tend to like it's more out of annoyance than mm -hmm. like I'm mad at you. Yeah. You know, like I don't know. Yeah. I mean, I think we argue about like normal stuff. Mm -hmm. Nothing weird or crazy. Mm -hmm. So once I assume that you eat out pretty much all of your meals. <laughs> no. It's actually that's actually pretty funny that someone would even say that. We we don't. Like, we definitely get into habits where, like, I think last week we ate out, like, a bunch just because we were, like, if we're super busy or, like, super tired, um, we'll eat out. But, like, for the most part, we cook at home. Yeah, I cook every day, all the time. Yeah. Um, she no I longer lets cook. me cook because she's a control freak when it comes mm -hmm. to the kitchen. Well, mainly because I'm just, like... I just like to like create things like out of nothing. Like I don't like to like follow like a recipe or anything. I'll just yeah. be like, oh, I think this will go to good together. So like, let's try this. Yeah, it's mainly like that. Yeah, mainly like we both really I like have to a cook. Plan. Though. I'm a Virgo. Okay, you guys are couch potatoes. Into, I mean, I definitely am. I get into ruts where I'm like, oh, I love like watching you know certain shows or whatever. Like I've. Like rewatched all of the seasons of Pretty Little Liars by myself. But I, I am like a couch potato at the end of the night. But I go to the gym almost every day. Mm -hmm. I would say five out of the seven days of a week. Yeah. I go to the gym. I run. I do everything. So I'm like I'm not a couch potato in a sense of like I don't ever work out. I'm yeah. like a couch potato like at the end of the night when I'm exhausted. Yeah. But That's also I, like we'd rather be at home on the couch than like out. Yeah, at we're home bar. bodies. We're home bodies. Yeah. So. I assume people judge your relationship a lot. They do. Yeah. I I mean, that's actually accurate. A lot of people um, think that like, you know, because we don't post a lot or whatever, like maybe we're not happy or we're not fun or like whatever. And it's or like- also because we don't like make out like in videos, people assume that like, we don't like each other or whatever, but it's also yeah. like, we don't have to prove to you guys that we are a couple. We don't have yeah. to prove to the world we are a couple because we are a couple and people who make out in videos just to make out in videos. It's like, they're trying to prove something yeah. when it's like, you don't, you don't, you wouldn't, like you're kissing because you know the camera's yeah. watching and you put it, you edit it and you put it in a video yeah. because you want people to know how in love you are yeah. when it's like, this and is like a real relationship. People yeah. don't just kiss all the time. People no, are just it's like a, cuddly. And yeah, like, and like I think that's the biggest thing. That's <clears throat> that's actually one of the top things that like super annoys me about like a lot of couples on YouTube and stuff is that they're overly lovey and stuff to the point where it's like they're putting on a show for you because normal relationships like 
we're we're married. We have a boring like normal life, you know. Yeah. Like we're not fucking so, making out on the couch. But then, you but know, then when these like couples job. like yeah. break up, people are like shocked. But it's like they're portraying like ten percent of a relationship online yeah. when it's like more real life stuff. Like we yeah. go to work, we do normal things. Yeah. And, that's our life. And, and also, life. in my opinion, if you're having issues in your relationship, I think you put more, you sexualize your relationship a lot more online. Um, that's just my personal opinion. That's um, just what we get from all the couples that have broken up that have done that. Yeah, so. Anyways, next. See? That you actually didn't like your short haircut. No, <laughs> I hated it. What was I doing? It was cute in the I, beginning. It was for a month. I liked it for a month. Yeah. And that was literally it. Yeah. So her hair is like down to like here now. No, she, it's down to here. Oh. Well, she doesn't like wearing it down. I think it looks cute and she wears it down. You are not shy to hold hands in public. No. No. No, we don't care. Yeah. We're gay. Whatever. Yeah. Although I do have to say, like, we hold hands about half the time in public. The other half the time is Alyssa sprinting to wherever we're going. I'm and a I'm, walker. And I'm behind being like, hey, got little legs over here. <laughs> you gotta go slow. I'm a fast walker. I'm like, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, especially if we're going to eat somewhere. Like, oh, then I get excited. I get left in the car. <laughs> I get excited. You guys don't cuddle a lot while sleeping. And I know that, you know what the craziest thing is? I know that no matter what we say in this video, it is going to get contradicted and it's going to be twisted into something that means nothing. So let me just say this. Yes, we do not cuddle at night. And here's the reason. Because I am really like irritated with my body all the time, I move every like five minutes. I literally flip in my sleep every like five, freaking minutes and not only that I get like hot flashes like every 10 seconds so if I'm cuddled up with someone like I'm literally burning like inside like I we were feel my body burning last we night. were like facing each other last night and she like we were watching friends in bed and she like like was holding my hand and stuff and all of a sudden she's like your hand is burning hot and I just got a hot flash yeah like, and I was like I literally just got a hot flash like, like we cuddle sometimes yeah like, it's not to say that we don't ever cuddle or it's, anything it's, like that it's, it's just, mainly just like I literally flip every like five minutes so it's like how annoying would that be if we're like cuddling and all of a sudden I'm like okay flip yeah and then flip and then it gets flip. hot like and and <laughs> it, it's hot flashes and it's I also moving. I also radiate a lot of heat <laughs> yes and I'm just like which is why I often sleep in shorts and a t-shirt like, and I'm just like sweating my ass off yeah like so don't take that as something that is not we're not we're like, still we, happy we don't we still have sex beds. like yeah me, me, me. it's still yeah it's still a thing it just yeah it gets hot yeah. um sam is better driver than you but i mean i would say we're equal drivers honestly yeah. because like I get in a car with anyone else and I get nauseous. I when you drive I don't get nauseous. Yeah. And so and I think vice versa you don't get nauseous like when I drive like mm -hmm. I don't yeah. think so. So I think yeah. that we're honestly equal drivers. Yeah. I just drive more. You spend more <laughs> money than Sam. No. Do they? Do you guys know us at all? Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. She acts like she has an endless bank account that if just I like gets spend, money put into it every five seconds. If I could spend <clears throat> some, like if I could spend money as my job, that would be great. I mean, that's technically a buyer, but a lot more goes into it. <laughs> but still, she. No, I, I love buying things. She <laughs> is a spender and I am a saver 1000%. Yeah. That is the reason we have a savings. You have a boring sex life and or lupus gets in the way of sex. What? Who do you know <laughs> that has lupus? What do you think lupus is? I think people have this like preconceived like notion <laughs> of like lupus and like I think the problem is like no offense to this person, but like I think people see the one person that the worldwide people would know that has lupus, which is Selena Gomez, and she had a lot of these medical problems. She went through chemo, and thankfully she came out of it healthy. She no longer has lupus, but there were, one there's different types of lupus. She yeah. had lupus nephritis, which only affected the kidney. So now she's okay because she doesn't have that kidney. She mm -hmm. got a kidney transplant. Yeah. But also she had a really rough time because lupus nephritis is one of the most intense forms of lupus that you can get. I have systematic lupus and I've been in remission for almost two years. Mm -hmm. I work out almost every day. I actually have more energy than this one. Yeah. And Tiff and Jess put together. <laughs> I'm constantly working out. Yeah. Like, I think people just have this idea that like I'm just like bed bound and yeah. I'm just like not okay all the time when I'm the one who's actually like, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's yeah. go, let's go. 
Yeah. Like I'm so energetic all the time. Yeah. Even though like, I'm never constantly stops. fatigued. Like yeah. so no, it does not affect like our life. Like no. it doesn't affect you at all. No. What and what has lupus ever once Your allergies more affect me than your lupus does. Yeah. <laughs> has ever once in our entire relationship has has have I ever complained or have I ever said anything where lupus stopped us from doing anything? No. Never. No. Right? Like there's been other things like when you got off birth control and like you had acne which caused like major depression, like that prevented us from doing things. Like you you know, your allergies prevent us from eating certain places or whatever. There's never been a time where it's like you're like so fatigued that you can't like get out of bed. Like there are days when like you are more fatigued than others, but it still doesn't prevent you from doing things. It's I'm not still like, like you're let's yeah. Go, let's go, let's go. Yeah. I mean and like the thing is is that people think that like Everyone that has like disease, you know, a, a immune disease or a disability or whatever, like it prevents them from having like a normal sex life, and that's not true. Like people with disabilities, like can still have a normal sex life. You know, their parts still function. You know, so it's like having this having this disease or disability isn't going to necessarily prevent them <clears throat> from physically being able to do something yeah you know people, unless I don't unless know you know it does there are like, diseases and stuff that are yeah. but like i just don't know what people think that lupus is and i think also people don't put two and two together like people have this idea of like what lupus is and then people see me and then they don't put two and two together that like i'm fine yeah. like i'm good and then like people see like lupus and they're like she's going to die She's yeah. bed bound. And I'm like, what? Yeah. There's, there's also stupid. different, like, there's like a spectrum of like people with lupus too. Yeah. A lot of people have lupus. Like, and you probably wouldn't even know. All right, last one. Alyssa is actually more emotional. No. <laughs> no. No. Who the hell do you think you done to do? Right? I cry at everything. She cries at everything. I, Kelly, I cry at Kelly Clarkson. Yeah, that's true. You did. You cried twice, <laughs> which was really sweet. Um, yeah, I mean, I cry over everything. I like a character cry. potentially was going to die on Grey's Anatomy last night, and instantly I was like, she can't. And I was like, it's cool. Yeah, no, I'm solid as a rock, <laughs> and she is crumbling dirt. Yep. <laughs> I am a sandcastle. Yeah. <laughs> One wave away from a tip over. <laughs> All right, <laughs> anyways, we hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a big old thumbs up and what else should they do? Subscribe because we put out videos randomly. Yeah, <laughs> yep, we do. We're really fun on other social platforms. Mm -hmm. but anyways, we love you guys, but don't make it weird. Always make it weird. And ain't nobody know. <laughs>